What is up you guys? So as you know, I just got new headlights with new lenses. So um, I wanna do my best to protect the new lenses. So I'm gonna be applying some paint protection film on top of the new lenses so that it could be protected against like uh, road debris and all the rocks and chips and all that. So it doesn't get any uh, chips on it like my old lenses did. So in this video, I'm gonna be showing you guys the process of applying paint protection film to headlights. This doesn't apply just to my uh, BMW 90 headlights. This could apply to any headlights. So the things you're gonna need to do this are a hair dryer to apply some heat on the paint protection film. Uh, the paint protection film itself, I got this off Amazon. It's the three millimeter Scotchgard uh, film. Um, you're gonna need some soapy water, a little cutting tool, and a squeegee, and then some soft uh, microfiber towels to clean up the headlights. So the first thing you're going to want to do is clean your headlights. So you could use the soapy water solution and wipe it down with a soft microfiber towel. Next you're going to want to measure and cut a piece from your roll of paint protection film. I was able to do both headlights using this 12 by 60 inch roll of paint protection film. Just make sure not to leave too much access on your horizontal measurements so that you have enough for both headlights. Once you have peeled off the paint protection film, you're going to want to spray the sticky side with the soapy water solution, and then you're also going to want to spray your headlight with the soapy water solution. Make sure to also spray the area around the headlight on your paint so that the paint protection film does not stick. The soapy water solution allows you to position the paint protection film without it sticking. Once you position the film, you can take your squeegee and begin pressing the soapy water out from underneath the paint protection film so that the adhesive on the paint protection film will be exposed and begin sticking and conforming to the headlight. You're going to want to start from the center of the headlight, moving outward towards the edges of the headlight as you're using the squeegee. Once you have reached the rounded areas of the headlight, you can begin using the hair dryer to apply heat to the film so that you can stretch it out so that it can conform to the rounded areas of the headlight.
told her I own it. Now, as you may have seen, I was struggling with the left bottom corner of the headlight. Um, it wasn't sticking. So I used this other solution called Tax Solution that I forgot to mention at the beginning of the video. This solution allowed me to get the pain protection film to stick on that area of the headlight as you can see now. This solution is a mix of isopropyl alcohol and water. Whatever bottle you use for this solution, you're going to want to fill it up 30% with the isopropyl alcohol and the other 70% with water. You could either use the 70% or the 90% isopropyl alcohol solution for this. Once you have completely and evenly stuck the pain protection film to the entire headlight, you can begin trimming the excess with your little cutting tool. Once you have finished trimming all the access off, you're going to want to use your squeegee to fold in the outer edges of the pain protection film that are kind of sticking out. You're going to want to fold them in underneath and around the edges of the headlight the best you can. This part I had some difficulty getting the adhesive to stick around the outer edges of the headlight, but in the end I was still able to make it work. Alright guys, so here's the finished product. Um, it looks pretty good overall. Uh, the hard part is just doing like the edges, like around, like around here, especially here. It's hard to like get a clean cut, but I mean, it still looks pretty good, and you get the added protection. So I mean, it's not that big of a deal since you need the protection. I already did this side. And here's what it looks like with the halos on. Still looks very clear. Still looks really clean, so I think it turned out pretty good. Still looks Oh my goodness, it's so 
badass. I love these head these headlights. See, as you can see, like I, I didn't get a clean cut around the headlight. It's pretty difficult. But I mean, it still looks really clean overall. From far away, you can't really tell. It's only when you like really get up close and look at it. Well, there you have it, guys. There's the process for applying paint protection film to your headlights. Now, as you can see, it's uh, sunny out now, so this process takes about like maybe an hour to two hours, uh, depending how like slow you go or how skilled you are. Uh, in my case, it's my first time doing this, so it took me like a couple hours for both headlights. So yeah, uh, overall, it's not. It's not the easiest, but it's not that difficult either. It's like a moderate difficulty. Um, so yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Thank you for watching, and I'll see you guys in the next one.